Intersecting shapes basically means combining two shapes in such a way that only the area that overlaps remains after you're done with the operation. It doesn't matter which layer is on top because the result is the same. Let's see how this is done. We will create a rectangle and we will create an ellipse. Ellipse is going to be dark gray, the square is going to be black. We arrange them so that there is a certain overlap, select them both and then go to here and click intersect selection. So what is important to note is that similar to subtracting shapes, the result is going to be a special kind of group that contains both of these original shapes in their original form. So you can manipulate around and adjust the final outcome very easily. You can change the size and the position of each of these shapes. And also after you're done with this operation, you can, for example, round corners and create very organic looking shapes that you can then again move around and create very interesting things. If you want to get rid of this group, you can go here and click flatten selection or press command or control E. This will create a whole new shape and remove the original shapes. I recommend doing this only when you are 100% sure that you want to commit to this outcome. Otherwise, you'd have to redo that. Whereas if you keep these original shapes, you can easily adjust anytime. And that is how you intersect shapes in Figma. If you found this video useful, I'd appreciate you leaving a like. And if you're interested in this type of content, go check out my channel for more tutorials on Figma. Thanks for joining me and see you in the next one.